Grady Go to my heart so you cannot take it To my mama, I know I'ma make it Nigga run up, we still in the Satan Stay the same, no, I ain't not changing For the fame, I'm chasing the greatest Really, I'm losing my trust, not loving the whole What's up, Sneaker Grant family? I'm back again for another banger video for you guys. This day is a new day. So, of course, let me get great. today, guys, I got to talk with another banger because I will be doing a video talking about the top five places where you guys can get affordable and nice looking graphic tees from. And yes, I want to say about like three out of the five or four out of the five places are places I've actually shopped from. And the other ones are just places that I've heard people or my friends and my peers have shopped from before. So I'm going to go ahead and put you guys on. And yes, three out of the five spots are going to be online shopping places as well. So yes, the other two are definitely nice spots that you guys can go, and you know, you can go into and then buy your tees, you know, see how you like the fit of them in person. And then yeah, but yes, I hope you guys will enjoy today's video. Let me know what you guys want to see in the comments down below. Yes, I do appreciate you guys for all the love and support you guys have been showing. It really does mean a lot. Yes, if you guys haven't, go tune into my last video I did talking about the top five underground streetwear brands you guys should know about. Yes, it was the part two, and y'all kind of went crazy on it. Like for real, that's been like one of my top videos that I posted out of all of them lately. So yes. Definitely go ahead and tune into that one if you haven't already. Yes, enough with the chit chat. We're gonna go ahead and get to this banger video now. And right, yeah, so for the first place I do want to talk about when it comes to where to get affordable and nice graphic tees from is a place called Grail. Yes, Grail is an online store. Yes, it's basically similar to like how eBay is set up where you guys can buy or you guys can resell stuff and you know people buy it. And yes, basically it's more you know based off of clothes and you know fashion stuff like that more than how it is on you know other goods like what ebay has but anyway grail is really a great spot yes if you guys want to know what the app is boom right there grail is a really nice spot yes my friends have shopped there you know a lot and yes i've seen them they never really had no problems yes every time you buy it's through paypal so yes if anything happens you can dispute the payment and then you good i've been on grail for like a hot minute yes every time i go in there and want to look for something i always see something that i like yes basically what you guys can do like you guys can search up graphic tees or, you know vintage tees and yeah, you can filter it where the price is set to you know a specific range or even just put in your size and then boom any result that you want will come up yes there's always something there that you guys could want and yes i know some of you guys are really into fashion you still also have stuff like number nine tees you know helmet lane what else rav there's like a decent amount of stuff they'll have they'll even have chrome hearts you know they'll have vivian westwood tees maybe like they'll always have something available for you guys but you know that's more like on the expensive side but you know on like you know the budget side right now so yes you guys can just look up like old vintage tees or like band tees or you know you can just look up you know just um regular black t-shirts with a print on them like they have like a decent amount of stuff that you guys can go and look at but yes grill is the first spot and yes, the only thing i would really say about it is look out for the sellers because some of these sellers be taxing just know what sellers to shop front and what sellers not to because some of them be taxing and some of them will have some really nice steals that they just don't know about but yes that is the first spot grill gonna go ahead and move on to the second spot where you guys can get affordable and nice graphic tees from now and yeah all right guys so for the second spot where you guys can get affordable and graphic tees from is fashion over and so if you guys do not know what fashion over is it's basically you know an online clothing store and it has all clothes you know it's a company they sell stuff for men women and i think they even trying to get stuff out here for kids as well like they have a lot of stuff yes fashion over it's really like a really it's similar it's similar to like how h&m and pack sim etc it's kind of similar to like how they have it set up but it's you know instead online it's mainly online you can't go into like a fashion over store in the mall or something like that they should think about doing something like that though but fashion nova if you guys do not know what the app looks like boom right there yes fashion nova i have a couple of tees behind me that i'm gonna show you guys but i'm gonna talk about you know the tees and stuff like that for a little bit i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys a couple of tees that i got from them for like what the past six months to a year but I do want to say their prices are really, really affordable. Like for the tees be like $15 all the way up to like, you know, the most like 30, but that's still a decent amount for a graphic tee. So yes, this first one I got is a Mary J. Blige tee. You guys seen this one before. Nothing really too much to talk about it. Red tie-dye, black panel in the middle with the print of Mary J. Blige herself. Then we got, you know, like this dark red or like dang near burgundy, you know, faded red tie-dye at the bottom. Yes, if you guys really want this tee, I would definitely say, that when you get it and wash it, wash it by itself. I'm letting you guys know, I'm warning y'all, wash it by itself. But yes, the next tee I have is right here. Yes, it is a Rolling Stones tee. It's similar to like how this tee is right here, the Mary J. Blige tee. It kind of has like that tie-dye design on it, but instead it's a cross. Yes, I really do like this one. Yes, as you guys see, it's more of like an oversized fitting. Like both of these are kind of like an oversized fitting tee, but this one's very, very big. Cause you know, Fashion Nova sometimes they'll have like a lot of 
you know, stuff like the big guys too. Yes, I am one myself, like I'm six foot two. So I need like, you know, you know, bigger and longer clothes. But this one is so long, like this joint come down to about like my, almost my thighs. And that's long. Fashion Nova is a good spot to get like, you know, oversized gravity tees from, I'm just saying. And the last one I'm gonna show y'all because this clip is kind of getting too long. We got this Metallica tee. I really do like this one. It's my favorite tee I've gotten out of Fashion Nova. Like this tee, was probably the coldest tee I ever got out of Fashion Nova. Like, this joint is so tough. I like the faded design on it, the Metallica. And then like like on the gray, ooh, I just dropped it. Like on the gray, it's like a faded out gray where it looks, you know, kind of vintage as you guys can see. Like it came like this. I thought that was interesting. But yes, Fashion Nova is a really good place to get y'all some nice graphic tees from. So yes, definitely gonna type in with Fashion Nova. Yes, Fashion Nova, you guys wanna sponsor me? <laughs> Hit me up, you know, my email in the description, so you know, hit me up or DM me on Instagram, whatever you want to do. But, yes, that is the second place, Fashion Over. We're going to go ahead and move on to the third spot where you guys can get affordable graphic tees from now. Yeah? All right, guys, so for the third place where you guys can get affordable graphic tees from is Underground Streetwear Brands. Yes, I'm putting y'all on. Underground Streetwear Brands have really nice you know, really, really nice graphic tees. And yes, there's a couple of brands that will have them for an expensive price, but there's two I'm gonna be naming specifically that have, you know, tees for a really, really nice, affordable price. Yes, first place I do wanna mention is Num Studios. And yes, I mentioned that in my last video. So if you guys want a little bit more info about them, go hit up my last video and look at that video. But Num Studios really just has some really nice stuff. Yes, I'm gonna put a couple pictures of the tees up on the screen for y'all. So yeah, boom right there. You know, this tee is very nice. And then boom right there as well. Hopefully they're both, you know, both beside me. But yes, Num Studios, they really do have some nice stuff out. Yes, they have like, you know, simple graphic tees that are easy to dress with, but the design on it is, you know, it's sleek and clean. So, you know, ain't nothing too bad about it. Like, it's not like it's a bad design, like for real. It's nice. And yes, their tees, I, I was looking at the site, you know, probably like last night or two days ago. Their stuff is really, really unexpensive. Like for real, it was about like, what, $15 to like $25 for, you know, a graphic tee. Yes, depending on which one you get, You'll be straight. Yes, the next brand I do want to talk about that I was just looking at before I start recording this video is a brand called uh, Morgul Forever. I think that's how you say it. But yes, I'll put the IG right here. Um, boom, right there. But yes, that is going to be in the next Underground Streetwear brand um, video. But yes, I'll put a couple of tees up on the screen for y'all. Boom, right there. I really do like this one. And then boom, right there. <clears throat> and yes, their sizes, both of these brands, their sizes, their sizes range up from a small, extra small all the way up to a 2XL. So you never have to worry about them probably not having a size unless you're a 3XL or an extra, extra small. I'm sorry, gang. They both really have some nice TCS. So yes, definitely gonna tap in with these underground streetwear brands. Those are just the name of two. But there's a lot, a lot, a lot of nice underground streetwear brands that have some stuff for a great, 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 great price, especially with the graphic tees. But yes. That is the third spot. Now we're gonna go ahead and move on to the next two that are places you can walk in and shop at in person. So yes, let's go ahead and get into it now. And All yeah, right guys, so for the fourth spot where you guys can get affordable graphic tees from is a really, really nice place that I've got a lot of graphic tees from a lot. Yes, that is Target. Yes, Target, they really do hook you up with like some nice stuff. Like there's been a couple of times where I've worn some uh, t-shirts from Target you guys probably ain't know. Like I had a Boys in the Hood shirt. I still have it. It's probably like the washer, like, you know, my closet upstairs. I've worn that one in the video. Yes, I got that drink from Target. I have a couple others that are in, like, you know, I just washed them, so they're not on my hooks behind me. I have, like, one shirt from Target that I can show y'all. But, yes, there's, like, a bunch of inventory where you guys can get some really nice graphic tees from Target. Yes, if I'm not mistaken, they'd be, like, $12 a piece, or they'll probably have a special where it's, like, two for $15. You know, like, it just depends on what, you know, what's in your area when it comes to the Targets. Yes, the advice I will give y'all is to go out to, like, the Targets on, like, the you know, nice areas, you know, like the suburbs, you know, stuff like that. Go out to the ones in the suburbs, they're like, you know, the biggest target, like the biggest inventory that you know, because bigger targets equal bigger inventory, which equals a bigger amount of t-shirts that you guys can get for an affordable price. Yeah, I'm on to something. Target, I'm on to y'all. Y'all should sponsor me though. Yes, I do have one tee behind me that I can show you guys. Yes, I wasn't even trying to get a graphic tee. I went in there for my little brother, and then I ended up walking out with a graphic tee that I just saw. Yes, it is a Whitney Houston tee. I really do like this one. It's very, very simple, and it's very, very nice. And I've never seen this tee out of all the targets that I go through. Yes, that like 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 the average targets that I go to, they'll have anime tees, you know, sports tees, you know, Stranger Things tees, you know, uh, what else, like, you know, band tees. Like, I've seen Rolling Stones tees they have out there. Uh, what else I've seen? I've seen Wu-Tang Clan. I got that one upstairs in my room. Wu-Tang Clan, uh, Gravity's, Boys in the Hood. Like, they have a lot. 
But I, I thought it was cool to see a Whitney Houston tee. And that was the only area I've ever seen one of these in. So I was like, you know, I got to pick it up. They got my size too. I'm set. But yes, Target is a very, very nice place to get some, you know, nice grabby tees from it. Let's not even speak on the price because you already know the price is going to be straight because, you you know, you shopping at Target. Like for, they'd be like $12 for one tee, which really is a great price if you ask me. Yes, the one thing I will say about their tees though, do not put them in the dryer if you guys do not want them to shrink because I put a couple of my tees in the dryer from Target and they ended up shrinking. So if you guys don't want that to happen, definitely, 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 you know, let them just air dry. It's the best thing. And also put them on cold when you wash them as well. Put them on cold, help you guys out. But yes. Target, a really, really nice place to get some affordable graphic tees from. Again, yes, that is the fourth spot. We're going to go ahead and move on to the last and final spot that I just got put on onto like a month ago. I went there and I picked up a decent amount of graphic tees that we'll be showing y'all. Just without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it now. And yeah, All right, guys, yes. so for the last spot where you guys can get affordable graphic tees from is TJ Maxx. I know, TJ Maxx, like for real. I went there a couple weeks ago and I saw so many nice graphic tees there, like for real. And I got some behind me, I'm gonna show y'all. But I saw them, I was like, yeah, this is this is, this is definitely going to the video if I talk about graphic tees. But yes, TJ Maxx, I know it sounds crazy. And yes, again, similar like how I said with Target, go to the, you know, ones in the nice area. Yes, I went to a TJ Maxx, I don't like, you know, a low key spot, but you know, it's a nice area. I went there, I found some nice stuff, you know, it's like in the old people area, you know, old people, when do you really see them wearing like the, you know, the trendy, uh, gravity type stuff. Never. They they just stick to you know they polos, you know their little um what they what they call them, like jackets, and then you know some jeans or some jogging pants, and they you know Skechers slippers. That's what they stick to. But I do have some I'm gonna show y'all. So yes, for this first one I got right here. It's similar to my Metallica T-shirt with like the gray on it. As you guys can see, like it looks pretty fire. Yes, I got an Outkast shirt. Yes, if you guys do not know about Outcast, your childhood must have not been it. I'm saying it right now. Yes, turn that around. What'd that say? What'd that say? TJ Maxx. Like, for TJ Maxx, they have some really nice stuff. Yes, this is literally a $13 tee. I have a Playboy shirt. Playboy shirt, if you guys do not know about Playboy, it's better that you don't know, but just know it's a magazine company, we'll say. I can't. I couldn't believe they had Playboy shirts in TJ Maxx. That don't sound right. They had Playboy shirts in TJ Maxx. But yes, this is one of them I got. I got a white one too. It's right here. I got a white one. I thought this one was fire. I thought this was the best one out of all of them. It says Playboy spelled out right there. You know, nothing else on the back. Like for this, is like, you know, simple graphic tees you guys can get. Honestly, I think that it's worth it. I think all these tees were around the same price as this one, $13. So yes, TJ Maxx, I'm putting y'all on right now. TJ Maxx, Go to your, you know, local TJ Maxx, or if you if you out and about and you see you happen to see one in a nice area, go stop in there. You might walk out with a couple gravity tees that you guys can wear during the summer. And yes, also know that like for gravity tees can last you so long because you can layer them. You know, you can wear them like jean jackets, or you guys can wear them with like uh, what else, the flannels, you know, zip ups, whatever you guys can do. Like for gravity tees, go a long way. Like for I have one on right now under here. But hey, we ain't gonna talk about that. But yeah, so I hope that you guys did enjoy today's video and I hope that this video did help you guys out when it comes to where to get nice and affordable graphic tees from. Yes, let me know what you guys wanna see in the comments down below. I'm trying to stay consistent as possible for you guys. Yes, summer, I'm literally on one because I, like, I've been branching out a lot and doing other things. Yes, I will say this. I started making music on some cool stuff. You know, I was just bored and wanted to make some music. So yes, if you guys want to listen to my stuff, you know, give it a shot. My name is Mist Uzis. Yes, Mist Uzis. And yes, I'm on all platforms. I'm on Spotify. I'm on SoundCloud. I'm on YouTube. I'm on Apple Music. I'm on Amazon Music. I'm on all that. So yes, definitely go check me out. Yes, I'll put my name or I'll just link it in the description where you guys can go, you know, look at my uh, first song. And yes. Hope you guys do enjoy that. YouTube is like one of my main branches, but I want to, you know, do some other things as well. But this video is getting way too long. So yes, I'm going to end it here. I love you guys, honestly. But yeah, Sneaker Family is the biggest, littest family on YouTube. Yes, we branching out. So you already know we getting bigger. But yes, go listen to my first song. It's called Riding Alone. And yes, it's by my stage name. Mr. Uzi, you like, for real, we switching it up. But yes, hope you guys will enjoy. Yeah, see you guys later now. And yeah, peace.